Hello and welcome to Kenmore, Washington. This little town is a waterfront suburb right next to Lake Forest Park and Bothell on the top of Lake Washington. If you are moving to the Seattle area or already live in Seattle and are looking for great neighborhoods for families, let's take a serious look at what Kenmore has to offer. This is Emily Cressy, your digitally enabled Puget Sound community advisor. Hi, this is Emily Cressy. I am a real estate agent here in the Seattle area. Today we are visiting Kenmore, Washington. I'm right at Log Boom Park, which is a waterfront park. We've got a boat marina over here where you can poke you, park your motorboat. Behind me is Lake Washington. If we're lucky, we might see some seaplanes take off. And then I'm, I'm in front of me behind the camera is actually some beautiful lakefront condos overlooking Lake Washington here. So it's just a, a fantastic location. Kenmore is actually a pretty small residential community just at the north end of Lake Washington between Shoreline and Lake Forest Park and then Bothell. And it has its own uh, seaplane takeoff business. So if you need to commute by seaplane, you can leave right here out of the north end of Lake Washington. You'll also see seaplanes landing on Lake Union, closer to downtown Seattle. And uh, my mom is an attorney. She's actually used these little planes to go to places like um, the San Juan Islands or up to Victoria, BC, Canada, just getting around the area in style. Uh, my friend had a, my, my childhood friend, uh, her dad was a pilot and he actually would rent an airplane on her birthday and take her and a friend uh, flying around and I would be able to see all over the area, see the homes and I was like, there's my yard, that's my house. And so it was, it was pretty exciting. Now here in Kenmore, uh, most of the folks have access to the North Shore School District, which is just a fantastically rated school district. Homes aren't cheap here. I would say a single family home is gonna start around half a million dollars for like a three bedroom. Uh, condos of course are less than that and you can get some in a great location. Uh, the, main, the main thoroughfare here is uh, Lake City Way that converts into Bothell Way and we're, we're really located between the two freeways, I-5 and 405. So if this is a place where you, you know, one spouse might wanna live in Seattle or one might wanna live in Bellevue, or I'm sorry, work in those locations, you could live at the top of the lake and easily access either location. Also gives you that security if, um, you know, you, you change jobs and you wanna go work on the other side of the lake. This is a really great access point for that. So. Uh, if you've been thinking about Kenmore, Washington, I live in Lake Forest Park, so I'll be your neighbor. <laughs> uh, but there's, there's a lot of retail along this Lake City Way, uh, Bothell Way corridor. So you're gonna have restaurants, Starbucks, bowling alleys, shopping on one side, and then Lake Washington pretty much on the other. We've also got um, the Burke Gilman Trail, which is a walking pathway. I think it goes like 26 miles or something. You can walk or bike all the way from here down to the University of Washington. So uh, if you wanna work at one of the hospitals down there or at the university itself, uh, it's great uh, commuter access. And then it goes around the top of the lake over to uh, the Woodenville area where you can go visit the wineries. So uh, that's a really fun weekend trip. And uh, if you like doing things outside, the, this whole lakefront area offers a lot of different options. So. Uh, I'm going to give Kenmore two thumbs up. Uh, it's not a place to work, but it is a great place to live. And uh, it's easy to get pretty much anywhere you need to go, even up to Everett is not a bad trip from here. So uh, if you have any questions about living in Kenmore, Washington, I would be more than happy to answer them if you're looking for a home here. I'm a real estate agent, so you know what to do. Hit me up, send a seagull <laughs> with the message, have it land on my arm and we'll, uh, we'll talk business, okay? So in the meantime, if you have more questions specifically about Kenmore, I want to know what your specific questions are so I can answer them more directly. So just put those in the comments and I will reply back or else I will make a video if uh, it seems like something a lot of people would be interested in. So what is it like to live in Kenmore? On a day like this, it can't be beaten. It is 75 degrees in April, this is unseasonably warm if you're not from the area. This is a gorgeous day and like always, the first hot weather day in Seattle 
It's actually been all weekend because now it's Sunday, but we've had gorgeous weather and people are just getting outside like crazy. So I'm here at Log Boom Park, which is a fantastic park right along the Burt Gilman Trail. So you can see over here, this grassy area, there'll be bikers and walkers and people going by there. And this trail runs uh, up into Bothell, down through Lake Forest Park to the University of Washington. It's a very long, nice biking trail, uh, very flat. It used to be a train track. So people are packing this thing like crazy. And we were here yesterday and there were so many kids on this playground behind me. It's uh, maybe a little warmer now. People have gone in, little kids are napping, but this has been a hot spot. Now over here is Lake Washington and you can see it is just sunny and so nice. We're right by Kenmore Air. So of course they've got the airplanes, uh, the seaplanes parked over there. I haven't been able to get one taking off or landing on video for you guys yet, but I'm gonna work on that. And uh, my daughter is actually over at the lake. Uh, we're here with a couple friends and they brought a canoe. We've got other people launching any kind of portable inflatable boat you can imagine down into the water to take advantage of this gorgeous, gorgeous day. So if you've thought about living in Kenmore, it's mostly residential. There's not a lot of nightlife. We kind of have Bothell Way as the main drag, which has, you know, churches, bowling alleys, Starbucks, restaurants, grocery stores, that type of a thing. Uh, the more industrial retail part of town, but this is very much a residential area. So over here um, in this direction, you can see some condos. If you want waterfront condo living, this is a great location and at the, the base of these condos on the other side of the property and also down by the water is a marina. So if you don't wanna leave your boat at home, you wanna store it, you can store it here at the marina and then you're just that close to the lake to be able to get in the water at any time. So my last video on Kenmore that I did, um, I'll try to post it so you can see it, but it was cold, it was winter, I was in my hat and I can't believe I'm already out here doing a summertime video. So you can really tell the difference. This area is starting to come alive. We've still got daffodils coming up. I mean, this is pretty early spring. We just passed our frost free date last week. So it's a warm spring. Don't count on this every April, but this is a really wonderful facility. They've got um, a crew team that meets over here. You can see uh, the crew boats and things. If you're a rower, you can row on Lake Washington. They've got restrooms over here and it's a small park but it's got water access and so it's a great place to hang out there's also the civic club uh just half a mile walking we get there it's down by the lake forest park town center so if you want a private club where you can uh, see the same folks more of a party atmosphere every week uh, you can join the civic club if you live in this lake forest park kenmore area but if you um, want a public access beach this has it all and I encourage you to come out and enjoy. Bye.